सो अमित भाई लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द वेरी हॉट क्वेश्चन हाउ टू बी आर सेल्स फोर्स एम बी पी लाइक हाउ यू बी आर सेल्स फोर्स एम बी पी इन सेल्स फोर्स इको सिस्टम Okay. So uh, I know that this is the in demand in demand question which is there uh, over the chat. So first thing is that if you are thinking to be an MVP, right? So that is where you are wrong. Like if you are thinking, I am going to do this for the community because I wanted to be an MVP. That's the first thing that you are in wrong direction. You are in a wrong path. if you are helping like if subham is helping multiple like many people subham is helping so uh, uh, he is helping uh, many people uh, and uh, is even getting appreciated so he is an mvp for them even salesforce haven't given the title but he is an mvp so the first thing that you need to keep in your mind is if you are making even a single person life uh, like if your life is affecting even a single person you are an, an mvp you don't need to be given a title by salesforce so everyone who is there out in the community who is giving back and people are get, getting benefited like in my eyes even in all the mvps who are titled by salesforce are thinking that everyone is a true mvp which is uh, out there in the community that's the first thing uh just a correction for all of you because everyone was asking mvp path and mvp path so don't think that you are not an mvp you are an mvp even if your parents life are getting affected with because of you you are an mvp for them you are the most valuable uh, uh instead of professional you will be a person so <clears throat> that's the one thing and coming to the mvp path there are the things that you need to follow like Uh, if you go to salesforce.com and say that salesforce.com mvp is so uh, there you will see the list of all the actions or we can say that the task that you need to perform throughout the year uh, it's not like that you did uh, one video every day for a month and then you said that i did for the complete year so that's not a kind of things you need to be consistent throughout the year so like uh, either you are active on developer forum you are active on salesforce extract exchange you are active on salesforce communities you are trying to be an speaker over various events and uh, you are writing your own blogs creating the videos so if you are doing all these things without keeping in mind like you are doing because of you wanted to be an mvp so what what you will think like suppose that uh, in initial days you thought like you are going to do this 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 and you will be an mvp next year So what what if you are not awarded as an mvp you will be sad right so the, the, my experience is the very practical experience i have experienced by my own itself not by others like i'm telling you my experience for the first time the first year when the result was announced many people were saying that you will be an mvp i was not thinking i will be but when people are saying that you will be an mvp you will be an mvp then definitely there will be somewhere in your mind you will think like i'd be i can be an mvp so that was my personal experience i was very sad throughout the day so i just went to uh, like uh, we just uh, had a butter chicken at that day uh, just in order to uh, get that sadness out <laughs> so that's what i'm saying don't think that you wanted to be an mvp just do that because you love it so i and subham and uh, multi- like many people who are doing even you can say that you are an mvp man that's why you are doing uh, you are not wrong you can say like that as well but even if not if i'm not mvp after one year like in, if i'm not getting renewed as an mvp in 2022 i'm not going to stop putting the videos and all because i know i am affecting many people out there who are there in, uh, as a subscriber in my youtube channel and who are my students over udemy's even you can create your own course you are helping the ohana you are not like you are earning money that's it but that's a part of community so you can create the course as well and the best part is that don't ever try to like uh, make an inter uh, what uh, the word i'm not able to recall that word but 
don't try to be an anti with any existing MVP. If you are not a friend, don't try to be an enemy. So that's the one thing that you need to keep in mind. The other thing is that you need to find an MVP mentor for you. So if you want, if you wanted to follow an MVP path, again, you are following an MVP path. You are having an MVP mentor. Again, you don't need to have a thought in your mind that I am doing all these things. I have an MVP mentor and I'm going to be an MVP. Don't think about that. Just do that. And if Salesforce, because they have a team, um, the complete team about that, every MVP is going to review your com uh, whatever the contributions that you did in the last year. Every single MVP is going to review. And then if they say yes, then again, those will go to Salesforce professionals and then they they will say that okay then they will again review if they found it useful and you will definitely be awarded but Salesforce again can't give that title to everyone that's why they started champion program so if you are even a champion that is equivalent to MVP so there are multiple champion program like uh, a lightning champion analytics champion Einstein champion marketing champion quit champion a Pyrodot champion. I believe in near days there might be a financial champion, health cloud champion. So you can part take participation on those as well. And uh, if you are awarded as a champion, you are an MVP. And if even if you are not awarded as a champion, you are an MVP. If you are doing something, I will definitely call you as an MVP. And uh, I can bet you, like I can give you in return, if you are in in a crowd, in a three thousand or four thousand people. And you you ask me to say that uh, please call me as an MVP. I'll definitely call you in. I can do an announcement for you as an MVP. So don't think like that, and just try to give uh, give back to the community. And if you are doing uh, without like uh, expecting a return in a like expecting a return, you will definitely get a return. I said Salesforce follow some set of rules, right? So if you are following those rules, then you will be awarded as an MVP. And uh, you you uh, named the correct person is an uncrowned MVP and is also dear to me. And you know that we all three are very good friends, uh, like uh, brothers, uh, brothers from another mothers, right? So uh, he's an uncrowned MVP. But whenever I had a talk with him, every time we came into the conclusion, right? Our aim is to give back to the community, not to be an MVP or something else. So that's why every time we try to uh, come up with a different different programs like I came up with a new program for mock interviews where I can give the real experience for the interview for multiple professionals, many professionals like right? you are came, you came with a new series, which is flows. We came to know that there is very less content. So you decided to work on flows. I decided to work on mule socks. So that kind of thinking if you ha are having will definitely get back so if you say uh Kasdeep, even Akasdeep is getting more mm, swags and goodies than me i'm exactly. an mvp but i'm not getting exactly <laughs> so, so there are benefit but that doesn't mean you are an mvp then only you will be get benefited so you can do uh, participate in trailhead uh, challenges trailhead quest you can participate in multiple uh trailhead meetups you will win the swags and you will get those so again, uh, like uh, it's, I just want to say, uh, the reason why I suggest students or uh, let's say fellow uh, mates that start creating your own personal brand. If you are creating your personal brand today and start working on it, let me tell you, you will be in Salesforce MVP in the upcoming years. And that's the major key which going to help you to make your own identity in the ecosystem, right? That's where people yep. came so, to uh, know about you that, okay, this is the person who is doing something different from others. Yes, Amit Bhai, please proceed. Yeah, so what I'm saying is that you are right. So if they are creating their own content, Right. So even uh, if they are right, I'm not saying they are going to be an MVP because I don't want it to make any statement. Mm -hmm. But if they are creating a content, think about yourself. Whenever you are trying to create a content, what what are the thoughts you have in your mind? You are creating a video trying to give every single information about that topic. 
so you will learn more and more you might try uh, you might see my video you might see uh, some other uh, videos you might see some blogs uh, and uh, and after you will try to get the butter from those right so you are giving the butter to the people so if you are writing your own content so what you are doing is you have a milk and out of that milk you are giving butter so you are making your base strong so if you are not being an mvp you are increasing the product price and at the end what does matter is the money money and happiness so if you are earning good money there are many people who are not mvp but earning good money so don't think about that way think about how you can be happy how you can uh, um, earn more and more money and if you say that if you will become uh, if you will be an mvp you will be unhappy and let me tell you my friend you are wrong so yeah so that's the part uh, like uh, where many people are getting confused like how to be a mvp i guess uh, all those confusions are cleared or swept away from your mind like if if any yep so if still you have please feel free to contact me one to one and uh, i will make sure that you are on the right track not going to brainwash your uh, brain so you don't need to uh, worry about that but i will guide you the right path